Okay, so, you know, I get asked questions like, how many feet per second in HDR 68s that you modify and sell on DKSpencerCustomKinetics.com, trademark. <laughs> so, um, obviously, you know, normally the tanks are Cerakoted, but this is one I just shimmed for the, for the purpose of this. We're also going to check and see how loud it is with the old thingy. <laughs> All right. So here we go. Max feet per second. I'm using Berna Kinetics because that's, you know, the lightest thing I got. So here we go. So there you go. 522 feet per second is what uh, one of the ones modified by me does. Actually, I could get more than that out of it, I'm sure, but we'll see. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to test it with 9.9 .9 gram hybrid Canada riot balls for, uh, you know, power and whatnot. So this is what I'm set. This is like on my side. This is a 50 joule. Uh, and I'm going to link this video to the ad, but this is a 50 joule HDR. So I've got it basically at the power level that you can get without having to worry about it farting at all. So it's basically, you know, 50 joules. So <laughs> uh, we're checking it up there, not at the muzzle. So you're going to lose, especially with a 9.9 .9 gram, you're going to lose a little bit of speed by the time you get to there. So at the muzzle, if it's three, let's see, if it's 331 feet per second at the muzzle, that's 50 joules. So I'm going to say if it's anywhere 326 or, you know, around in there, up there, I'm going to call that a win anyway. But uh, <laughs> it's got to at least be 49 up there for me to be happy with calling it a 50 joule tune. Because if I did it at the muzzle, you know, you see what I'm saying. <laughs> at least most of you. The ones that don't, I don't know. <laughs> All right, here we go, here we go. Oh, yeah, this one. 327. All right, so three, uh, 327, that's 48. 331. Well, I guess I didn't need to explain all that, did I? <laughs> so we're 50, we're 50 joules at the target, not at the muzzle already. So we'll, uh, yeah, we'll call that a win. <laughs> Okay. So what will 50 joules do to some 26 gauge steel? That's a good question. <laughs> Here's an answer. These are homemade uh, Z-Gram clones, which we always give away like some free ammo with any of these that are purchased. Hopefully this will not ricochet and hit the phone. Um, actually, as you can see, <laughs> and that's not multiple shots in one place, that's one shot, one penetration. Good times. Bad, bad focus. Good times. Also, penetration. Or at least, you know, it, it busted its. <laughs> busted its. Oh, that one didn't busted its. 
for my homies. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, I forgot I still got this freaking thing zoomed. Look at that, that's crazy. All right, so yeah, <laughs> cracking 26 gauge steel, 50 joules, good times.